I figured I'd do a quick video. Um, group of Facebook, uh, Freedom for the Wolf or Freedom of the Wolf. I figured I'd do a quick video. Um, like showing you guys all my wolf stuff. Since I am a huge wolf enthusiast like myself, I mean. I figured I'd give you a little tour of my room. I don't know if I did it before. But, I figured why don't I give you a little tour. Yeah, I guess I'll start right here. There's a couple of uh, knick-knack to wolf pups right there. Um, little, little uh, thing my mom got me. Oh, shit. I'm going to knock it right off the dam. Yeah, right there. Little thing my mom got me. It's got the stopwatch to it. Come on. Come on, focus. Problem is fucked up with this camera. So, uh, I think my mom got me is a stopwatch to wolves on it right there, the stopwatch. Put that back right there. There's two. There's two frames in the back. There's a nightlight right there. One right there. Let's see. A couple of pictures on the wall right here. One right there. There's one behind my heater. There's another one right there. Two wolves howling behind the moon. You seen this one before on a on, uh, video I had like this before? Can you sloop this? Puzzle of two wolves right there. I like that. My uh, some of my family gave me that. Another one right there. That picture right there. That one actually moves. It's actually holographic. Like if you move them side to side, there and the picture actually moves. So you actually see the picture move. If you like move left or right. One right there, my cousin gave me that. One over the side of here. There's one right there. Got another one on the side here. Go walk, walk back up, back up, back up, back up. Walk on the wild side. This thing right here actually lights up. But the battery died on it, so. Got another one of the. Take my lenses dirty. I can't really see it's about because it's dark, but. <sighs> Let me come back here. I got have the metal frame on the wall right here. There's the metal thing right on the wall. Got another one over here. And that's pretty much it, but I got a. I got a couple of more stuff. What is over here? Oh, shit. I'm gonna lay this down right here. Oh, yeah, there's a wolf mat right there. Get the fuck out of the way. There's a wolf mat right there. That used to be color, but so mat, so that's why it looks like that. I'm gonna lay this down right here so you guys can see this. Oh, shit. That is a towel that my mom got me. Yeah, I just love wolves, don't I? I got wolf stuff all over the place. Let me see something in a minute. Down. I got more stuff right here, so give me a second. I'm browsing through it. There is hold on. Get this back up. This is arguably one of my favorite shirts. 
That's arguably one of my favorite stories. A dragon and a wolf. You see, they're like how they're like looking up at the moon. I saw that in the magazine. Like I had to have my mom get that for me. Just reading it out. Dragon and wolf right there. Two of my two of my uh, favorite things in the world: dragons and wolves. There's another one right there. Hold up. Now this this sucker. Oh. Let me lay it down flat. Let me lay it down flat for you so you guys can see a better view of it. That right there, it's another one of my favorites. I love this freaking shirt. I guess this is like a really rare shirt to find. Because I got this down in Orlando, Florida back in 2008, I believe. And, and if you look on the side... You can tell I got it in Orlando, Orlando, Florida, because on the side here, on the, on the sleeve, come on, kind of flat nose so you guys can see the whole thing, whatever it, what it says, you see it right there, it says extinction is forever Orlando, so that's proof right there that I got that down in Florida, got it. Got a shit. It's inside out. Inside out. This is a. Uh, I'm not even gonna try. This is a. Um, that's a wolf. Uh, thing for like the pillows. Wolf pillowcase. And yeah, that's it for the clothes I got out of the wash. Now. Uh, no, I got some in here. I will show them all to you. Ah, I found one right here. Really? Damn hangers. Oh, come on, really? Of course, there's a hanger around it. Fuck. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Friggin' hanger I caught on one of the shirts. There's another one right here. You can see it right there. It wasn't us on it. It's a nice looking shirt. There's another one that I got in Orlando. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Another shirt I got in Orlando, you can see right there in Orlando on the bottom. Sitting that out. See so Orlando right there, another one of my one of my favorite shirts. Where do we see that? Is that a, a bear paw print or is that a wolf paw print? To me, it looks like a bear's. I'm about to hell they got a bear's paw print on it. And this is, uh, let me just hang right quick. This is another one. Uh, that is a Outdoor Legends shirt. Timberwolf. Crazy about these freaking animals. I got so many of them. <laughs> That's a freaking sweater. What the heck is this? Shorts. Now this one. This one you're about to see. Is arguably one of my most favorite. Because of what's on it. This is arguably one of my most favorite shirts. Hold on, let me flatten this out real quick. You're getting a good look at it. That right there. That is one of my most favorites because it's got the American flag on the back because wolves represent America. I don't give a damn what anybody says. Uh, they said that bison is America's animal. I don't believe that. I mean, what you're seeing right there is America's animals. Wolves have been roaming the wilderness for so for centuries. Without this country, without this without, uh, wolves, there won't be the United States. There won't be wilderness without wolves. It's one of my one of my all-time favorites. Wolves standing in front of the American flag. Ain't nothing better than that. All right, let me see some here. Browse through some more. 
Ah, yeah. <laughs> another one. Another one right there. Back up. Another one right there. That is so cool. This is the one I love wearing the most. This one right here. I love all the wolves howling on it. You got the American flag colors behind it. What could be better? If you're a wolf lover and you're from this country, get a, get a shirt with the American flag and uh, wolves on it. You know, ain't on better than that. Let me see some. Let me see if I got any more. That's one of my. This is um one of my coats. Yeah, I'm showing you guys everything because that's how generous I am. All the wolf stuff I got. Come on, flatten it out. This is one of my coats. I wolves on the back of that. I wear this a lot when it's kind of nip, kind of nippy out. One of my coats. This right here is one of the coolest shirts I got. This is one of the coolest ones. I love walking around wearing this. That's one of my favorites. <laughs> that. That's one of my favorite ones right there. The snarling wolf on the front of the shirt. That, I love walking around with this on. This is one of the, the most coolest things I've ever seen. I always wanted a shirt like that with a snarling wolf on the front of it. One more in here. Good good hanging when he's back up though. And this is the last one. American Wonders again. There you go. You got a thing on a wolf uh, uh, bed sheet right there. Yeah, so basically you guys have seen all my wolf my wolf stuff. Oh, 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 oh. How could I forget? How could I forget these? I have to show you my, uh, I forgot to show you ones up here. How come I doing? You see, I got, um, wolf knickknacks right there. Since it's in the dark, I really can't see it. It's more right there. Yeah, I like collecting knickknacks with, uh, wolves on it. It's nothing I like doing. That would tape on the bottom of this. This is, a, this is the one I saw off my mom. <laughs> I saw this off my mom. <laughs> yeah, we got some some knives right here with wolf patterns on them. Shit. Shit, 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 back up, back up, back up. You see the wolf patterns on the knife? Yeah, I don't know if you can see, see the, 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 the engraving on the blade, the wolves on that, it's on both sides. Uh, this right here is arguably one of the coolest things. This is a switch blade. I like it because it's got the, the wolf on the front of it. It's got the wolf's head on the front of it. You see right there on the side. It's got their wolves running. Let's see if there's any markings on this blade. Yeah. That's what there will be. I'll show you guys everything right here. Look at be better than that, man. What could be better than that? Look at that. And a cool ass freaking por cool ass portrait. God, these animals are so fucking. Uh, I've seen my language. God, those animals are so awesome. We got a tomahawk right there with, um. Really can't. I can't pick that Tom Oak off because it freaking broke. So I'm pissed. I got a a mug. 
You got a mug with a wolf on it. You got some nizzle, you got some... Wolves are very voracious hunters. They can bring down prey up to 10 times their size. Can devour up to 20 pounds of food in one feeding. Their powerful jaws are able to exert twice the pressure per square inch than that of an average domestic dog. There is a rhythm in nature that can be felt through the songs of birds rustling the trees and water trickling over rocks. Got some patterns right there of them. But what they said about the wolf on the side of this cup is definitely right. I don't think anyone ever wants to get, uh... Oh. Before I do that. This is what I'm going to show you. I started this long video, but I got a lot of stuff. I apologize for this. So I'll be... I'll be forwarding... I'll probably be forwarding this through YouTube. I'll just copy the... Just copy the page. To the Freedom of the Wolf thing, so you guys can all see this. As you can probably see, that is a big wolf blanket. I love this thing. Because of the design on it. This same thing keeps me warm every night. I don't know how many times I went, I got sleep through cold nights because of this blanket. That right there. Is the animal of legend. They ain't the bear. It ain't the bison, it ain't the elk, it ain't the mountain lion. That right there is the animal legend. I don't think any wolf, wolf haters say, that's the animal that's the icon in this country. Uh, go over here for the last one. And there's some bookknacks right here. I'm going to show this off. Walk right by it. Yeah, I, these were just weren't together, but I just had to, like, put the mom with the pup. I had the pup, like, right underneath her legs. And we already got one right there. Beautiful freaking, uh... Oh. Now, this is kind of embarrassing. I mean, I, I shouldn't be showing these, but you know what the hell with it. I got wolf slippers. <laughs> and I'm, I'm going to show one more thing. This is right here. around so you guys can see this. This is my uh, wolf. See right there? That's my wolf. My wolf plushie. I love this thing to death. I always hold this thing close to me. It's like I always have like it on top of the couch right there. Like I I guess it like it watches over me when I sleep like keeps all the the bad dreams out. But sometimes I get a little bad dreams and I so. So, um, yeah, this thing's like a like a dream catcher. He goes in and fights all the, um, like the bad demons off and stuff. He goes in there and pr protects me from them. So, yeah, I mean, that was my room. So all my wolf stuff. Um, it's for the Freeman of Wolf uh, Facebook page. And before I get out of here, I just want to say one thing. But every that statement I said on um earlier in the uh, in the, the statement I said earlier, I meant every word of it. I'm dead serious. I meant every word of it. Like I'm so sick and tired of seeing, you know, all these pictures of these cowards, these jackasses just sit there and smile with dead wolves in front of them. You know, it's disgusting. I'm like. Who are you trying to impress? Like, real? you sit there and you smirk in front of these pictures like you're doing something heroic. You think you're big and bad. Like, you think you're tough or something. All these backwoods, imbecile dickheads who fucking think... Uh, I'm, I'm sorry for cursing. I apologize for that. I, I I can get a little crazy sometimes. I apologize for that. But... These people got no lives. I mean, it's like they purposely go out there and harass these animals. But... I don't want to make this video too long. I don't want to have you guys like sitting through a like 20, 30 minute video. So, I just want to say like, you know, wolves are the icon. The wolves are the icon of the wild. I've said this many times. Wolves are the icon of the wild. They are the top animal. And I blame 
such stupid stuff like the Three Little Pigs and Red Riding Hood and all this other crap. I blame stuff like that. Is the reason why wolves are demonized. Because these stupid people believed it. They believe wolves are savage killer creatures who go around murdering everything inside like when all reality they do not. Because I got two books in that closet. I've read both books. I don't even know if I'll be able to find them. Well, let me see something in a minute. Let me see if I can find these books. I know they're in here. Ah, here they are. Here they are. These two books. I encourage you, all you people. I encourage you guys. Freedom of the Wolf. I encourage you guys if you even got it already. Read that one right there. The Wolf Almanac. Very good book. It's a very good book. It tells you all about wolves and all the, all the other stuff. It tells you all about it. It's a good book right there. Then you got this one. Wolf Empire. This one right here. Wolf Empire by Scott Ian... Is it Barry? Yeah, uh, Scott Ian Barry. I read this whole book from beginning to end. Back up. Oh, too far, too far, too far, too far, too far, too far. Back up. I encourage you guys. If you haven't got those books already, go out there and pick, uh, go out there and pick yourself up a copy. Very good knowledge in, um, on that book. Especially Scott Ian Barry. I give a lot, of, a lot of credit for him writing that book. So I encourage you guys, go pick that book up. Go pick both of them up. If you haven't gotten them already. It's good information. It tells you all about what wolves are. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and close this video. I don't make it too long. I don't want to keep you guys bored having you watch the 23rd maybe like I said earlier so and uh so I'll upload this to let me see so many words today so I will upload this video to freedom for the wolf Video will be uploaded there. When I upload my YouTube channel, I don't think I can upload this long video in there, so I'll upload my YouTube channel and I copy and paste the link to this so you guys can look at it. Tell me what you think. Like I said, true wolf enthusiast right here. I love them. I will never turn my back on them. So you do what you gotta do guys. I love you all. I'm glad to be part of the group. I'm glad to be be there with you. Alright. Peace out. Love you guys to death. See you next time around.